intro video. Oh my God, let's go intro video. <laughs> Boom, and there it is. I want to make sure that my audio is on. You guys let me know. Let me double check over here, see what the audio is. Yeah, I remembered it right before I supposed to have been talking because I keep switching my microphones. What's up, everybody? This is DTM Delta Tango Mike back on with another live stream. It's a Wednesday, so on Wednesdays we talk about vector artwork. The Wednesday World of Vectors, I did spell it correctly, right? World of Vectors. Yeah, sometimes I type really fast and I don't know what's happening. So here we go. Big ups to everybody in the Discord already hanging out. We got D, RB, Gareth, and Steve. So let's say RB, D, Steve, E, and Gareth, E, and uh, hanging out. And then, of course, already in the chat on Behance, all the cool people in the house in the place to be. RB says, what up, though? And Misty got beat out by RB to be the first one to leave a, a comment in the chat. Boom, boom, boom. Very cool. <laughs> Gareth in the house. Again, uh, we, we hang out everywhere on the chat and Discord in the chat on Behance. It's your choice. Just leave a comment. We want to know who you are, where you at. A couple announcements for tonight. Um, I will be working on the iPad with Adobe Illustrator. So let's go ahead and start that up while we're sitting here because I don't know uh, if my file is updated. And, uh, and a couple other things. This is my last stream for uh, this month. My uh, next stream will be December 12th. So I'm taking a few weeks uh, for a break. I will be uh, visiting LA. We got, Misty is in the chat. We're going to be hanging out with Misty for one of those days and uh, just say hello connect with folks if you are in the LA area or in San Diego let me know yeah uh, yeah yeah we love to meet up and say hello in person and uh, you know maybe drink a cup of coffee do a little sketch I don't know something like that let me know so that's the uh, a part of today's announcements the other part is we are as a, a sketching and drawing discord group as a collection of artists and creatives it was uh, rb who came up with the idea yesterday and uh and so today we have made a decision and uh that's part of the special announcement that you can see in the chat yes in person dtm sighting says uh, misty uh the special announcement is that we are sending a device to one of our sketching and drawing members li who lives in a different part of the world so we're accepting shipping contributions to the cash app listed in the description of this video. So if you see the announce the, the text in Behance, then now you can uh, send a shipping contribution to that cash app, Azalea CG. Azalea, it's our corporate entity. When I say our, I mean mine and my wife's. Um, when I do graphic design illustration, I do it as the artist DTM, Delta Tango Mike, but all the billing and invoicing comes through Azelia. So that's our, our corporate name. And, uh, and so since uh, RB brought this up yesterday, I thought it was a great idea to support one of our own in the Discord who's been uh, part of the Discord since the very beginning. And so since uh, uh, we're able to send them a device. I got the box already ready to go. I need to change some of these stickers and all. We have a device ready to uh, ship out in the next couple of days. So we're asking for everyone to contribute whatever they can to the shipping because it's going from the USA to a whole other part of the world. And uh, I was looking it up. I was like, geez, oh my gosh. So we have a device. So now is your chance to contribute to the community and uh and give what you can there it is bam all right so there we go let's get to it if you want to talk about this a little later in the discord we can do that right after the stream all right so there we go boom did my job talked about what i need to talk about let me see where am i right there right there there we go yeah all right so yesterday and uh sketching and um uh, Vector Maestros, got to remember what I'm doing. Vector Maestros uh, class, I started uh, to work on some iconic characters. 
And so I'm going to continue working on that today because it's something that I have to finish as part of a project that I've been working on for NFT. And so the deal with this NFT is that it includes characters. NFT series uh, includes a bunch of characters who are part of a comic book that it will also be an NFT, a comic book that I'm writing. And uh, I was hired to write it and hired to draw it. It's a great idea. It's a great concept. And, uh, and so I think that we, we are going to um, really make it really, really good. But it does require a whole lot of work in the beginning. You know what? This ain't it. So this is what I was waiting on. I need to see my thing update. So come on. Let me open up Illustrator on the desktop and uh, close all these apps. Come on, iPad. Making me look bad. Adobe Illustrator. There it goes. Look, it's it, now you can see it sinking. Yeah, it's got the little little blue circle right down the bottom right corner of that first image. There it goes. Bam. Mm -hmm. Does it look right? I think it looks right. Let's go ahead and click on it. And I need to be able to see. So come on. There it is. There you go. I knew it looked better. Oh, what's up with the text? That font. Oh, there it goes. There it goes the fonts. Okay, good. So... So the idea is to create some icons that the project um, social media people, which is oh, a couple of us, can use on Twitter, Instagram, and all of that, and the website where we talk about the project. So I'm looking for how to turn up the opacity all the way. So something is uh, busted. Anyway, so there it is. So this is the quick sketches that I did with Sketchable on Monday, actually. This past Monday, I did the sketches. And uh, and I came up with the idea, well, this is this guy is the main guy. This is the, uh, the main character right here. Uh, let's go right here. Come on. You got to be careful about clicking stuff. All right, here we go. Yeah, this guy is the main guy. He's the main guy. And he has four different forms that are um, that uh, that that collect together to become the the big boss. I think they're called the underbosses in the big boss. And so, under the underbosses is an army, and each army is made up of four different elements. One one element each. So that's the bone army, electricity army, energy army. And the fire army, and that's where we are right now. Because I was working on the big boss, and I was like, "Well, I'm still undecided about this." And maybe you guys can help me out. Can help me out by telling, by letting me know what if you saw this icon somewhere in the related to whatever a project, and which one is more appealing to you, the the outline version? Or one that has some solid parts version, and uh, and it's not going to stay inside a square. That's another thing too that I got to think about. Like I don't want it to the icon to live inside of a field of color. I want that icon to be able to get slapped on wherever, right? So, so, uh, so you guys, let me know what you think about that. In any case, that is the big boss. From the big boss, we got the other the under bosses, and they're they're going to be different colors with a couple of different adjustments that then lets you know that they're, those are the underbosses. So I'll get to those eventually. Right now, what I want to work on and for the next hour, which is going to go on for one hour, is that uh, the, the underlings. These are the underlings. And so I started off with the body. I want to just start with the body. I'm not going to go crazy detailed because this is supposed to have been an icon. And uh, and on Monday was supposed to have been just a thumbnail, but I can't. It's it's impossible for me to just keep it simple. And so I started going too crazy. And this one I try to keep it simple, and it just looks ugly. And that one is like I don't even know what's happening right there with that guy. But uh, but I I, I tend to go a little bit overboard. And I even uh, toned down the amount of art that was gonna go for this character for the underbosses and the big boss because I already had like a whole upper body going on. And it's like, yeah, that's too much. This is too much on on these ones also. So I think I'm going to do more like a bust. So here we go. Let's get to it. Let me see. And I did uh, fix my layers. So let's lock all this up. 
Let's see. Those are shadows that I don't even use anymore. I don't care. Let's lock all that up. There we go. Boom, bam. And so my technique when drawing anything is to just go ahead and um, use the pen tool. It's the easiest thing in the world. Then we have the direct selection tool. So then you can click on something and uh, select it. <sighs> Uh, yes, bust. Okay, I was like, hmm, what was I supposed to do? So, so we have this shoulder on one side. I can use my direct selection tool to click on any of these anchor points and look and click on the trash can and boom, that anchor point is gone. So then I can move this around like this. There we go. Let's go like that. There you go. Do you see that? Does that make sense to you? Let's go like this. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. Boom. That's the shoulder. So tap that anchor point right there. Trash can. Got it. Let's fix this. There we go. Bam. Okay. Mm-hmm. I like the idea of having um, a bus. Kind of like a like a statue bus. That would be cool. Okay, 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 okay. So get the uh, pen tool. Boom. Drop a anchor point right there. Go like this. Drag it. Now, the cool thing about Illustrator on the iPad, there's some certain shortcuts that are available to you because it's designed, Illustrator on the iPad is designed to be mobile friendly, touch friendly, using the pen, which is a good thing, but then that also means some things that you're used to doing on the desktop is not, not, is, is not, is not there. So it's kind of limiting. Uh, let's say big ups to Elisandra. What's up, Elisandra? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. And so so here's one of those things that's really cool. You have the anchor points. You can move them wherever you want. That's basic, right? You already know how to do that. That happens on the um, desktop version. So let's go like this and then bring this one back. Boom, there it goes. But then another one cool thing that you have on the iPad version is that you can double tap an anchor point. There we go. Boom. And it turns into a curve. Oh, my God. You can double tap it. And then it turns into a corner. So you don't have to sit there and mess with the uh, handles if you don't want to. <laughs> but then, of course, if you tap a um, anchor point, you do have these controls down here on the bottom. Whenever you have an anchor point or something selected, there's always a little extra uh, menu in case you need to do some things. I don't know exactly how these scissors work. I tried. It's a few things that I, I'm still not comfy with. Mm, all right, so let's go like this. Boom. Let's go like that. Bam. Boom. All right, there it is. So that's cool. Now, he, before I go crazy, and I the idea is if I did a silhouette like the one up here, it might look great, but it might look great if I have a combination. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do a combination. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, 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 okay. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. All right, all right, all right. So, so in that case, um, oh, yeah, yeah. So let's go ahead and get rid of some of these anchor points. So let's go like this and like that. Look, boom, right? Mm-hmm, yeah. Select that anchor point. Trash can is gone. So there's our lines. All right, so then let's bring this back here, bring that back there, back there like that, and make this side bigger. Okay, so now we tilt it, twisted the head a, a little bit. Got it. Um, I need a different layer because I'm experimenting. I'm not going to knock all this out right now, especially not on the iPad. I think the iPad and Illustrator on the iPad is a good tool for when you're on the go. I plan to be traveling in the next few weeks, and so I'm taking my iPad with me. I am taking... Uh, a surface also uh, but it's easy to sit there and tap 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 and draw on the iPad but when you're getting ready to do some serious amount of work for hours on end man the tools that Illustrator on the desktop has there's no way out of that you, you just gotta have it uh, and so that so right now I'm gonna experiment with this one but we're no guarantees we're gonna finish the other ones, we're going to try to finish one. So let's lock this bones new. This layer 21 is going to be a fill in. All right. And so we can do something like this, like this. Boom, like that. All right. Boom. 
Yes, there you go. There you go. Yeah. So that through the use of shadows, we can have that um, that bust, you know. Uh huh. That could be our icon. Icon. Okay. 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 So let's unlock that selection tool. Move the head up a little bit. There it is. Yeah. 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 I think I like it. I think I'm cool with that. Okay. Uh, so just got to remember certain things, right? So one layer is for the shadows. Another layer is for the outlines. Uh, Elisanda says I'm washing dishes at the moment. Uh, well, uh, at least I'm uh, you're off work, Elisanda, and uh, yeah, use that moment, this time to cleanse your mind. Listen to my voice. Listen to the art stuff, and uh, and come on over and wash our dishes too. <laughs> No, no, no. I'm glad you are hanging out with us, Elisandra. I appreciate you. All right. So here, I have no idea what to do other than let's uh, give it like a skull. There we go. Oh, yeah. Let's, get, let's zoom in. And I'm already starting to get really too detailed. Like some of this stuff should just be simple. But no, Dan's got to make it complicated. There we go. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So the bones is one of the characters that I've already drawn. And the, uh, the actual illustration for the bones uh, character is uh, it's very intricate. I've been working on it with Adobe Fresco. Oh, there's a new update. Okay, another uh, the brush set by Kyle Webster. Fall of 2022. Oh, because winter starts in next month, isn't it? Uh-huh, so, okay, I, I will allow it the fall. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute, isn't it winter? It's already getting cold. Uh, D says, uh, let Dan's soothing voice wash away your worries. <laughs> so this is the character. Okay, this is the character right here. Let me, let me, let me show it off. We've, uh, we've been doing some live streams with the uh, NFT community showing off this artwork right here. Still not there all the way with colors. There's still a lot of detail I'm working on, and uh, but uh, but all in all, this is the artwork. There's the guy. The day I came up with the stains, you know, on the skin, I was like, oh, that's super great. Like, oh my god, let me show you his chest. Like, boom, there's stains on the chest. You know, I was like, yes, that's super cool. Anyways, and then the eyes, like, you know, deep set. Is that what you call it? Deep set you know uh, eyes that they're, they're focused and so uh, so this is the character and he's an underling and uh, he's the bones underling and that's who we're making this icon for so after you've seen that it's a reminder what it looks like so let's make the head a little bit bigger let's see if we can grab all of that mm -hmm. uh, hold down the 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 uh, touch modifier and then go like this. Ah! Just. Let's see. Not, not so big. Is, did it change? I don't know if it changed. Okay, come on. There we go. Uh, pen tool. And let's do the horns. You know what I have seen? I've seen artists who use the pencil is it the pencil tool yeah to do stuff like that i need to do that more often with illustrator you gotta get into that drawing mode in illustrator on the ipad because um that's what's gonna give you uh the the the, uh, the power in your hand to do these things you know so there you go uh what's up steve hanging out in the chat thank you for stopping through the chat man there we go. Let's fix this. Yeah, let's go like that. There we go. Mm, there it goes. It's like a horn. Let me see if I can move the whole horn. Come on. There you go. It's kind of getting out of the, the, the my uh, self-imposed limit, but I can't help it. It's got to go. It's got to go. Okay, let's use the pencil. What else we got? Uh, paintbrush and blob brush. Yeah, I'm not going to use the blob brush right now. Let's go use this. 
That's all right. I kind of like that. Okay, okay, okay. All right, so let's do some eyes. And then the the nose was normal. It was a normal nose. And then he had teeth. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. I don't know. I'm not too crazy about it, but it's okay. Let's move this out a little bit, and move this back a little bit. Move this back. There you go. Uh huh. So let's do redo that again. Let's get it again. Okay. Okay. I'm kind of scared because I'm really more used to the the pen tool. Like I, I have full control with the pen tool. <laughs> Only the coolest people in here, says Steve. That's right. That's right. All right, let me draw something else because I'm not happy. Okay, that's that wasn't the tool we need. Let's go with the pencil, and now let's go here. All right, that's cool. I think it's okay. To some extent, it's okay. Let's go right there. Grab that, and there it is. Ah, oh, he's mean, man. All right, let's go here. So there has to be the teeth. Now let's go kind of big with the teeth. All right, all right, that's cool. I like it. Now that we're gonna do the the other part of the teeth. I do like the fact that on Illustrator on the iPad, you can uh, rotate your screen. Uh huh. There we go. Yeah, he looks mean. All right. This is cool. But she now has more drawing, whereas this is very, uh, what's the word? It's, it's very um, basic shapes. So I don't know if I like that. I think the face is too much. Let's go like this. Let's do, let's do the face again. I'm not happy about it. All right, let's get rid of the teeth. Let's think about that. Because I like that, but I don't like this. So, oh, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. May, you know, maybe I, I may, I, I'm, I'm overthinking it. I don't know. Let's go with the bones. Oh, yeah, so there's. There's things that don't belong here. This this path right here for one of the, the uh, horns belongs in the other. Okay, here we go. Boom. This one belongs over there. Got it. And what's this? This is the shoulder. So let's lock that. Here we go. All right, so let's, let's use the pen tool and do what we can to do. Let's go. Let's just go like this. No teeth. No teeth. Let's keep it simple so it's consistent. Cause uh, that's that's what's wrong with me. I, uh, you know, as, as time goes on, you you kind of like to experiment and do things, and uh, and then you lose track of what you're supposed to. Act. Like I wanted everything to be consistent. I wanted everything to be a particular way, and uh, but you mess it up. Mhm. Mm okay. So then pen tool again. So let's go like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I'm okay with this. Because then it, it's, it keeps that, um, the same idea of the, of how, it's the same art style as this. And it's supposed to be an icon. What up, though, says Odari. Sorry, and late. Popping in the kitchen is dinner time. Uh, since Odari is listening now, uh, I forgot to mention this. Somebody has to take over the, the movie for tomorrow because uh, I am going to uh, be at a convention conference. I don't know what it's called. It's called DreamHack. It's a conference for uh, game makers and game uh, companies. And uh, I made a few games. And so I've been selected to participate in the indie track, the independent booths. So they have some booths set up for independent game publishers. As a matter of fact, I should have been talking about my game. What up, Ian Philip? Philpot, what's up? Joining us on YouTube, my man. 
Um, uh, so I'm going to be at the Georgia World Congress Center this weekend. And, uh, and if you go to my website, Visual Artworks, Art Visual, let's type it in right, Art Works, there it is. Go to my Visual Artworks website, visualartworks.com. Click on the games. You can see the games that I've already made. These are games that I've already created. And so down here, Draw Space Drawing is the game that we're showcasing um, um, it, it, at this conference. It's called Dream Hack. The place that the, the conference is called Dream Hack. There it is. Dream Hack Atlanta. And it's at the Georgia World Congress Center in Atlanta. I already I put the call out for uh, volunteers and folks stepped up. That's cool. That's cool. I got, I got some volunteers helping me because I got to be there every day all the whole time. And uh, it sounds cool in theory till you're stuck in those conferences and at your booth. And then you need to go to the bathroom. You're tired. You need to eat something to eat. And so, you know. So, look. You can play my game. Oh. And the volume. There you go. It's the volume. Look at that. It's a little ship. And you got to move it with your finger back and forth. Like that. So I made this game. Um, uh, and uh, and so I'm going to showcase it. I'm bringing some devices with me. All right, there we go. Boom. I need you. And uh, and so we're going to I'm gonna talk about it for that whole weekend. So anyways, to, set up is tomorrow. And uh, I have uh, a friend of mine. He's helping me set up. But we're not telling what time we're getting out of there, and uh, and you know, cause cause you think you I got a bunch of stuff that I need to pack sitting right here, of camera, and so you know you think you're packing everything, you think you got what you need, but then when you get there, you set up, you're like, oh no, I forgot this, I forgot that, so you gotta get back in your car and drive off somewhere to Walmart or or something, Best Buy, that's my store, Best Buy, and so uh. So anyways, um, so yeah, so I'm not around tomorrow. Odari says it's my wife's birthday uh, this weekend. The weekend. Wait a minute. Wasn't it last weekend? Odari, you coming out with stories, man. Anyways, it's his wife's birthday. Uh, so he's not around either. So maybe we just uh, have to skip uh, movie night on the Discord. So anyway, go play my game. Uh, it's going to be tough. There we go. Boom. There we go. Uh, it's going to be tough to beat my score because you have to you need enough time and strategy to be able to get it oh there it goes another life and look at all those bullets they're pencils he's shooting pencils yeah it's all right anyways i get excited about my games um <laughs> let's let's go let's get back to it so anyways special artworks there it is ah <laughs> steve says 21st birthday again <laughs> All right, let's get back to it. Where was we? Uh, illustrator. My man, Ian, how you been? I hope you are well. I miss you, man. All right, let's get back into this here. So we got this guy. Okay, he's Bones. So, okay, okay, I remember now what we got to do here. All right, all right, all right. See, this sometimes you have to step away from your artwork and come back to it, and then you got it. It's like, I got it. Let's get uh let's get the nah let's get the pencil. Let's get the pencil. So the pencil's gonna go like this, look. Boom. <sighs> my granddaughter was in here in my office earlier today. She found my, cause it's cause still it's still a little bit of a a mess. I just moved into the space here, so it's a little bit of a mess. I don't like this at all, and uh, and so so she sees my my Batman mask and my uh, Darth Vader mask. So she grabs the Darth Vader mask and and starts uh, walking around the room, and then she grabs my um, Batman mask, and uh, and that's when she starts yelling Darth Vader. Okay, mom, the artist. Let's see what you got. 
Among the artists left a, a, a comment in the chat, in the Discord. You can use Sketchy and shoot pencils at him for points. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I have a lot of other games in there on that Visual Artworks, Artworks website, so check it out. But I don't have characters. I do have one gorilla. He does shoot. So that's what made me think of that. So check out the games. There's a gorilla who's who's shooting pencils at sketchbooks. Yes, yes, yes. Um, all these games work best on mobile. Uh, Garrett says, uh, meant to meant to be going to see Aussie Floyd again next week. Don't know if I'll be able to go though. Okay, so so free tickets. Well, so many birthdays. My bro my brother, three friends, one friend's dad. Yeah, yeah. It's that time of the year, isn't it? I am says I miss your brother. I'll ping you to come hang out at the office with us. Yes, anytime, man. Let me know. Let me know. I want to do a stream over there. I want to. I want to find a cool spot where the city in the background. A couple of surface devices. Yeah. See, this is see this is more iconic. You see, I like this. I'm cool with that. That's a tough gorilla. Yes, you go check it out. Check it out, uh, um, Steve. It's uh, he's uh the gorilla. Is in the that uh, uh in my visual artworks list of games. Boom, there we go. All right, so we got um we got the spikes. Uh, it needs to have a mean face right here. Also, I just thought about that. So that's cool. Let's do the f let's do one of these. Let's see if we can do this. Yeah, so lock that, okay, and then go like this. Boom, there it is, and then get in tighter. There you go. Yeah, boy, that's what I'm talking about. Oh. Mm, na 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 na. Make him say, uh. Let's go here, add a, okay, so now I want to add a spike or horn coming off this shoulder. So the best thing to do is to grab your pen tool, knock out, put in a couple of uh, anchor points here. Oh, not that one. Let me see. Oh, why is it doing that? This doesn't want to do it. This is how we do it. Anchor point. There we go. Boom. Now I can grab this anchor point and go like that. See? Double tap. See? Yeah, see? Like a, the old school movies. And then grab this one. Go like that. Grab this one. Boom. There goes a the horn. Boom. Just like that, I put a horn on this guy. And let's uh, let's go like this. Huh. Let's go like that. It should have a horn right here on this side. What do I do about that? Maybe I make it solid. Let's do it. Now I can just go like that. Boom. So a combination of solids and uh, and, sh and uh, outlines. Boom. Okay, cool, cool, cool. And he's the bones. So we're almost done here. We're almost done. We're not going to sit here forever. We got to knock it out. There goes a circle. The circle's too little. Like this. And then a bigger circle. No, come on. Like that. There goes a bigger circle. And then let's move that circle right there. And add, and then duplicate this bone right there. Get the direct solution to. Ah. Come on. Come on. This is where I don't, I don't like. We don't like this. There it goes. Boom. Make that a little smaller. There you go. You got to like tap around to to get this. Um, get the the pen tool to disengage. Get to get the the um, anchor points to the, the what do you call it? Uh, Deselect. Ah, it's too much. It's so much. Okay, here we go. Boom. This kind of looks like a cat. So I don't like that. Let's uh, get rid of it. Boom. Bam. 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 
Gotta have monsters. So this uh, this NFT series is gonna be really cool because it has superheroes, it has monsters, it has monsters in the blockchain, and uh, a lot of uh, all the proceeds of the sales of the NFT and related um, IP, it goes to the the treatment of this little boy, his name is Victor, so that uh, they can treat his SMA. Yeah, it kind of looks like a cat or something. I don't know. But it needs to have horns, and uh, now nah, I just thought about this. So let's go like this. Let's go like that. There you go. Let's see if we can do it like that. There you go. This is better. Oh, yeah. Low rider. Drives a little lower. Oh, low rider. Drives a little slower. There you go. See, it's better. It's better. Ah, ah. It's got the horns and stuff. They go like that a little bit. Jimmy Flame, uh, is that, who is Flame Cat? What's up, Flame Cat? I thought it was Jimmy Flame for a second. Welcome to the stream. Boom, let's go there, there. And then, again, it's the manipulation of the pen tool makes all the difference. Oh, my gosh. There you go. Uh-huh, bam. Yeah, so so this is the bones guy. I'm gonna think about how can I make him really really unique so that when it's time to draw the other ones, um, there's enough of a difference. Here we go, like that. Let's go like this. Let's go like this. Oh, I know what to do. Here we go, like that. There we go, the chest. Let's go here. Got to get in tight so I can see. Boom. Nice, nice, nice. Well, this is DTM, Delta Tango Mike. Uh, find me anywhere on the internet, Delta Tango Mike. Uh, if you haven't... Oh, wait a minute. I changed my name to okay to Flame Cat. Okay, cool, Flame Cat. Um, if you want to catch up with some of the streams, Odari streams on Fridays and Saturdays, and then uh, and there's a ton of other artists who are streaming on the weekend here on Behance. I stream on Mondays and Wednesdays, except for the next few Mondays where I will be out of town. So no streams for me. Uh, I do have one stream that I cannot avoid. There's no way out of that. And that is with uh, Adobe Live. So I will be streaming on Monday at um, 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. But I'll be in the East Co on the West Coast. So it's going to be 1 p.m. for me. Yeah, yeah, that's what happens when you travel. Uh, let's do some more details. I feel like, you know, this is this is too plain. You know, I just... There we go. And I know it's plain. It's on purpose, but... Uh, oh, I know what to do. I know what to do. That's not what I want. Let's do it again. Let's go like this. There we go. Boom. Mm-hmm. Let's do another one. I love the, the pen tool. The pencil is real easy to to use. You can drop a a a, 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 a line somewhere, and then if you don't like it, you can pick it up and move it around. Look at this, like this. See, like this. See, this side I don't like, so let's get rid of that. And then the last thing, let's do a nose. We are going to do a nose. It's gonna look a little little funny. There it is. Yeah, boy. 
Okay, let's move the mouth this way further. Yeah. And uh, let's put an anchor point right here. And then I can move that anchor point down. Double tap. Boom. See, it's curved. It has curves. Let's go like that. He's smiling. Oh, he's, a ha he's happy. He's happy. Okay, let's bring that in a little tighter. Ha 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 Let's do some horns on this side over here. Mm-hmm. Okay. I think that's what we're gonna do for now. I, I feel like the more I do, I'm gonna re I'm gonna work it too much, and then uh, it's it's not right. So this is the bones, uh, new. So let's go with uh, uh, this, this this name of this layer. This layer is gonna be bones underling. Bones Ar uh, uh, army army army. Gotta keep it hardcore. Bones Army. All right. And then uh, open that layer. Bring this layer into that one. Bring this layer into that one. And boom, that's the Bones Army. Look, turn it off and on. Right there. And then Smarugon Underling. That's it right there. So Bones Underling. There it is. So let's uh, get that out. Get that out. Bring this guy in. And uh, turn me up. Oh, it's already up. What happened? Turn it off. Ooh, oh, yeah, so that's not good. We're not going to do that. So something is up with that layer. It has um, something weird. Oh, no, it's fixed. I don't know what happened. I don't know what I did. Oh, there it is. See? There we go. Select that layer. It's, uh, it's fine. Select what's in it. It's fine. Oh, so the, something is up with that blend mode. I did that. I did that, and uh, by by making a lot of changes into the opacity and blend modes, and now it's stuck. It's okay because I can always redo it. It's no big deal. But now that I see this here, uh, let's lock this. Oh no, lock it. Bones Army. There he is. Let's go ahead and bring it down a little bit. Oops, no. Bones Army. There we go. So it's inside the square. And then I can make an adjustment here, and we're done. We're done with this guy. There we go. Yeah, let's brace this up like that. Come on. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, you know, you kind of you spend a lot of time with little things, and sometimes it's not a big deal. Those little things are not a big deal, but... But I know they're there, you know, and um, I did a talk the other day at the school. That was on Tuesday. That was yesterday. Oof, it feels. And so we were talking about murals and how you go from drawing little to drawing big. And one of the things I didn't mention is like when you draw little, you can get away with some detail. But when you draw big, you need to make sure the detail is there. That's all. So Dari says, Looks good. Steve says cool. And uh saying Okay, Flame Cat. He was working on a YouTube channel. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Mom the artist says he looks like he would have a deep voice. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> yes. Well there it is. We got bones. He's done. Let's go to to the top part of our app and save now. Uh now that I have this body, this bust, I am going to uh make copies of it and go across these other art boards and then from there make small adjustments because bones uh, and then bones has a color is purple electricity is going to be yellow energy is blue and fire is red so uh so i gotta do all that i got works to do I, I may get to it tonight because uh i got other stuff that i knock out need to knock out before tomorrow so thank you very much for hanging out with me tonight. This is the Wednesday World of Vectors. I am DTM, Delta Tango Mike. I was drawing on my iPad with Adobe Illustrator on the iPad. Check me out uh, in a month when I'm coming back to streaming. And, uh, and don't miss out on the Sketch to Vector 
session next week on Monday. Oh my God, it's a uh, sketch to vector. Uh, this last week I was working. Uh, yeah, about a week ago. I forget when it was. No, it's not next week. It's some. It's sometime this month. I forget. Uh, so it's not next. It's not this Monday coming up. It's the one after that. It's after Thanksgiving. Um, but yeah, so a couple of weeks ago I was working on one of these drawings. There it is. It's stuck. And it's the pumpkin. But uh, so that's the only session I have coming up. After that, it'll be December 12th when I come back to streaming. Check the this links in the description of this video if you like to uh, contribute to the shipping for a device to one of our members. We're sending him a Surface Pro. A Surface Pro. Oh my God, it's not in here. That's why it's very light. In any case, this is just the box I'm packing it in. Uh, do drop in a uh, contribution to help pay for shipping because it's super international. Thank you, everybody. Gary says, thanks for joining, everyone. If you haven't joined the Sketching and Drawing Discord, why not? It's free. I am DTM, the Tango Mike. Big ups to everybody hanging out in the Discord. D, Mom the Artist, RB, Gareth, or Dari, Stevie. And in the chat, or the same names, <laughs> plus Elisandra and uh, Flame Cat. Uh, who is else? Who else? Who else? These are all, I already said your names. All of you are cool people. And on YouTube was my man. Ian, Phil Pot, Ian, we need to get together, bro. All right, y'all. Talk to y'all later. See you in the Discord. See you real soon. Catch you on the flip side. Peace out.